Hi everyone, my name is Turen. So God is saying that you are being framed. So you know when we talk of being framed, you can mean two things. It can mean uh, two things. Being framed meaning that someone has brought up false evidence against you. Someone has made up lies against you. And then now people are finding you guilty of things that you did not even do. And God is saying that if you are a victim of being framed, expect your vindication. God is going to be vindicating you. Like you could see in the case of Joseph. Joseph was framed by Potiphar's wife. He was accused of the R word. He was accused of doing something to her, yet he was innocent. Yet his hands were clean. But guess what? God allowed it to happen because he wanted him now to become closer to Pharaoh. That's why God allowed it to happen. So God is also saying that some of you who are being framed, your story is about to be quite an impactful one. Your story is about to change lives. You are going to be vindicated. And once you are vindicated, you won't even just be remaining in that particular position. God is going to be elevating you. And God is also saying that secondly, it's frame in terms of you know how you put a picture and then you put something around the picture you put a picture on a frame and then you stick it onto the wall god is saying that there's some of you who are about to be icons i've seen sometimes when i go maybe into government offices here in south africa you find that they put on uh the picture maybe of the government leaders in their um in their offices they have to put that up and some people who go to certain churches they put up they are leaders they put up their church leaders in their houses, in their offices, and other people, they put up people who were so influential in this world, in their pictures, they have like frames of them, they frame their images. So God is also saying that expect to be framed as well in the mighty name of Jesus, because you are about to be making an impact in someone's life. You are about to be put up in other people's walls in the mighty name of Jesus because God is making you great in the name of Jesus. Expect your frame to be put up, the frame of your wedding. Expect your face to be put up somewhere because God is about to be making you a global impact in the mighty name of Jesus, a global icon in the mighty name of Jesus. People are going to want to have your picture in Jesus' mighty name. So God is still saying in this life, you are still going to be framed by people some of you it's even going to be now the children that you are still going to have or the children that you have who are framing you. So God is still saying that greatness is still about to come. And also when they are rating the best of this kind or the best in these categories, now you are going to be there, part of that picture, part of that frame, because God is now setting you high above in Jesus' mighty name. Amen.